Professor Mary Field, I wish I could have had the privilege and opportunity to do this for you in person. I know that you absolutely would have loved this. And I hope wherever you are now, that you're loving it too. Magical. Vivacious. A wise. Inspiring. Unique. Ebulent. Pops into my head. If you were on the Saddleback campus, it was hard not to know uh, Mike. Anything he had to say was profound. It was new. It was vibrant. He just seemed to, I guess, that have incredible energy. Very well loved. He was passionate about what he taught. But he could take that passion and radiate it to others and captivate other people. And that's what teaching is all about. Seeing how how intrigued and engrossed the students were with him and the exercises that he would do and the activities to, to really not only to teach, um, um, but to, to show. You know, always envied his ability to really enthrall uh, students. And, oh, I, gee, I wish I could be just like you. You could be just like him. Yeah. Very special person. Not just to me, but to anyone around him, to faculty, family, friends, students. If you go to ratemyprofessor.com, he's a 4.0. Oh my gosh, what wasn't to like? Every time I think of my animal spirit, I think of him. He wasn't one of those professors that was like, oh, you just need to wait for me in these office hours. He was a, He made himself available all the time. Every year he would say, oh, I'm retiring, and every year he would never retire. I have a friend whose mother took him. His mother took him in the 70s and then he took him. So we're talking about he's taught thousands of students. I still have always thought about him and to hear of his passing, I mean, it made me cry. I was, I was very upset by it because not only was he just a rad human being, but he was one of my favorite professors at the school. I never really had a lot of teachers who would kind of influence me to do well. And he was just one of those teachers who, I don't know, who just kind of motivated me to do better. He was an awesome teacher. He's super smart. His witty behavior and demeanor, his jokes. He always had that um, mentality of indi- individualism and you know helping others. And I want to do that with my life, be, like, be more proactive and just continue his philosophy. My biggest and most fondest memories is watching him out in the quad with his students. You know, on behalf of the entire Saddleback College family. Uh, Our hearts and prayers go out to Michael's family, friends, and colleagues, and he will uh, be greatly missed. But then again, uh, he's given so much to our college and our community, he will never be forgotten. I think I'm going to use him as motivation for school and just for life, because he's just one of those people, memorable.